APIs started as a tool to facilitate access and integration, and they still serve those functions. But now, APIs can do so much more. When organizations start to think about and build an API-first architecture, they can build new digital ecosystems and create new business value. A digital ecosystem is a group of interconnected companies and products. This includes vendors, third-party suppliers, customers, and applications, just to name a few. A robust, well-connected, and multifaceted digital ecosystem enables businesses to create and monetize new digital experiences. The more you know about your customers, the better you're able to offer a truly integrated end-to-end -end digital experience. And the more services you have in your ecosystem to connect to those customers, the more you'll learn about them. So APIs are not only a long-standing integration technology, they are the fundamental building blocks of digital transformation. Let's look at Walgreens, for example, a large organization based in the US with thousands of brick and mortar stores. Their business includes a range of products and services from a pharmacy to photo printing to food and drink. Over the past decade, they embraced a culture of innovation and APIs were a key accelerator in their digital transformation. For example, one service they historically provided was photo development from film. With the advent of digital cameras and then smartphones, consumer needs changed. People weren't bringing in film to be developed anymore, so Walgreens asked themselves, how do we re-engage smartphone users with photo printing? Walgreens built the photo printing API. This provided a photo experience that allows developers who are building smartphone apps to connect to Walgreens to print out photos. So instead of only having create, edit, and share buttons for what an end user can do with their photo, there's also a print button that connects to any Walgreens store. In this model, Walgreens is partnering with the developer community to serve customers in a new way. The developers are a critical part of its digital ecosystem. Walgreens is therefore earning revenue from the developers as well as the revenue from the customers who come in to print their photos. Walgreens treated the API as a product, not just a tool for integration. That API has created an entirely new revenue stream and enabled the photo printing line of business to return to being profitable. But Walgreens didn't stop there. Almost immediately after it launched the photo printing API, developers in its ecosystem approached Walgreens with ideas for other types of products they wanted to provide their customers such as photo books, cards, and canvas cards. By investing in its digital ecosystem and engaging developers, Walgreens was able to further monetize its API and create new services to meet the demand. Another business that has embraced an API strategy to create new value is Monex. Monex is a global technology-based retail financial service provider. Their mission is to provide investors with the best financial services and liberal access to capital markets. They couldn't update their backend systems quick enough to deploy new services or even modify existing ones. So they developed an API to save them time and simplify processes of developing new products and services. With the API, they're no longer constrained by their legacy systems. Instead, they can develop services and smartphone apps more rapidly. They've unlocked value from their existing backend services using an API and are able to provide more seamless digital experiences for their customers. But that's not all. They decided to publish their API for everyone in the financial technology business that is developing new apps. This has transformed how their partner financial technology firms display customer portfolio balances in their apps, improving security and performance for their business partners. It has also placed Monex at the center of the financial technology ecosystem. While they initially had a team of developers who worked on the API program, they quickly realized that an on-premises API gateway wouldn't enable them to scale their program at the pace or at the performance they hoped for with the required built-in security. So they turned to Apigee, an API management platform. But hang on, 
What is Apogee? And what can it do? Check out the next video to learn more.